Hey Tiger fans, Ben Rosenbaum here inside CQ Arena. The Towson Tigers and Drexel Dragons were tied at the end of regulation and needed an overtime period to settle their differences. But then the Tigers and Dragons decided they wanted to spend a little more time with each other and they went to double overtime. Ultimately, the Tigers come out on top, 104-103. Mormon gets it over to Starr on the left side. Dump it left of the lane to Adalamoto. Ten on the shot clock. Reverse layup by William is up and good. And the Tigers take a 2-0 lead. On their first possession, able to score. They work it up top to Austin Williams. Feed in the left corner for Lee for a three, and he hits it. So there you go. Feeds it back up top. Mohica wide open for a three, and he cans it. Eight to four Drexel. They have hit two straight threes. Dribbles around to his left, hands it off to Mormon. Mormon to the foul line, out to Starr. He'll fire a three, and he rattles it home. Brian Starr with his first points of the ball game in his 13-3. Lee down to Johnson, gets it right side of the lane to Rodney Williams, feeds it to Austin Williams, who lays it up and in. 17-10, Dragons. Over midcourt comes Overton. Overton going to drive, takes it all the way to the hoop and slams it home. 27-20. Feeds it right side to Morcell. Drives the baseline, feeds it back to Starr. He'll fire a three-point shot, and it's good. Brian Starr with his second three. The Tigers have cut the lead to six, and Starr has six. Going to hesitate. Now feed it inside, and he throw it to Ba, who knocked it to Johnson. Johnson takes it to the hoop, and it's blocked from behind by Morcell. Rebound grabbed by Drexel. Shot no good. Now there's a pass to Morcell, who will go in for the slam dunk. 30 to 28, Mike with eight points. Get it to Rodney Williams, right of the lane. Backing in on a Dalamoto, both wear 24. Nice move by Rodney Williams, up and under. And he gets past William for the bucket, 38-32. Runs the lane, looking for Davis to throw. He didn't, John gonna back in, bank it, and score. John Davis with seven. And the Tigers down four, 40 to 36, with 2.30 to go. 10 on the game clock. Now to Mormon, back to Starr, dribbles in. Feeds it to Gorham, lays it up and in with four seconds to go in the half. They get it to Lee. Lee feeds it. Here's a half-court heave that's no good by Moran. And we will go into halftime and Towson with just their second lead of the ball game. Gives it to Lee. Lee down the left side to Mojica. Mojica cross-court into the corner. Johnson for a three. In and out, no good. Tap is up and in by Rodney Williams. 45-44, he went over John Davis to get that rebound and put it back in. He's grabbed by Rodney Williams, he's all over the place, he's got a double-double, that's his 10th rebound. Lee at the foul line, jump shot is good, and Drexel takes a 46-45 lead. Back to Williams, right of the lane, spins in on Davis, puts up a little hook shot, no good, follow is good by Mojica. 55-52 Drexel with 12.45 to go. Mike dribbles to his right. Going to take it down the right side of the lane. Turn, spin, shoot, and hit. Morcell with 17, and the Tigers down 155-54 with 12.28 to go. John Davis comes up with rebound number 11 to Morcell down the left. He'll fire a three. Got it! Mike Morcell with his first 20-point game since December 7th. And the Tigers have taken the lead 57-55. Hands it off to Mojica. Up top to Morcell. Mike going to fire a three-point shot, and he hits it. Mike Morcell with his fourth three of the night. He's got 23, and the Tigers up by five, 64-49. Overton feeds right side to Mojica. Going to drive the baseline, flip it out to Overton. Now into the paint to Rodney Williams, who stuffs it over Alex Thomas. He's got 21, and the Tigers' lead is down to one with 8.35 to go. Left side to Morcell. Mike into the paint. Mike crashes in. Basket is good, and he's fouled. Tigers' largest lead has been five. Drexel led by as many as nine. They miss the free throw, does Morcell. Adalamoto gets it, gives it to Morcell for three, and he hits. And a timeout called by Zach Spiker. Towson up by six, 69-63. Gets it to Austin Williams, left of the foul line. Up top to Mojica, lost control to Mormon. Mormon gonna take it all the way in for the layup. 
Deshaun with four points and the Tigers up 73-64 with 5.40 to go. Rebound grabbed by John Davis, number 13. And now pass ahead, intercepted by Johnson. He'll flip it to Lee, top of the key for three, and it's good. And a timeout by Pat Scary. Tigers' lead is now 75-67 with 3.59 to go. In to Davis with two, with one. Mormon going to fire it at the buzzer. No good, but the rebound at Dalamoto who lays it in. 79-70, William with 16. Lee up top, dribbles to his right. Feeds it to Johnson, going to launch a three, and he hits his third three. And it's a four-point lead with a minute 23 to go. Adalamoto has it on the right. Feed up top to Thomas. Get it to Morcell, left of the foul line. Bounces it down low to Adalamoto for the slam dunk. And a timeout called by Pat Scary. So the Tigers go up six with a minute four to go. Four-point game, 40 seconds to go. Lee over midcourt. Dribbling left, cuts to his right. Almost lost control. Ball knocked away, but it rolls to Overton. Overton down low. Williams slam dunk. 30.5 seconds left, Tigers up two. I mean, you want more sell to have the ball if they're going to foul because he's your best free throw shooter. Bounce it in, it's stolen away by Overton to Johnson. Cross court pass, knocked away, but Mohica comes up with it to Lee. 19 seconds to go, a two point Tiger lead. Lee, top of the key. Makes a move down the lane, goes up with a shot, swatted out of bounds, but a foul called. And Kirk Lee will go to the line to try to tie this game up with 7.2 seconds left. First free throw on the way is good. Second free throw on the way is also good. Gets it in to Adalamoto. Brings it over midcourt with five. William going to drive, lost control of the ball. Gets it back, puts it up. No good. We're going to overtime. Lee brings it over midcourt. Passes to his left to Mojica. Going to drive, lays it up, scores. Mojica with nine, and Drexel retakes the lead. 86-85 with 3.30 remaining. Ten on the shot clock. Davis drives in, puts it up, banks it home. John Davis with 12, and the Tigers up 87-86. Lee passes left side to Mojica. Swing it around right side to Overton. Down low, Mojica wide open for the layup, and it's 88-87. Drexel. Back out to Johnson. Johnson left side to Overton, going to drive, lays it up. No, tap by Williams is good. Or was there a foul? They count the basket and a foul on Alex Thomas and he's fouled out of the ball game. Lee brings it up over midcourt. Gonna drive into the paint, puts it up and scores. 93-92, 25.2 seconds left. Both teams have a timeout remaining. Lee will bring it up the floor. Gets it over midcourt, dribbles to his right. Comes down the lane, puts it up, high off the glass, and he hits it with six seconds left. Eddie Keith. Looking, looking, gets it into Davis. Davis brings it over midcourt with three. With two, going to launch a three-point shot. No good. We're going to double overtime. Adalamoto, or uh, Morcel gets it left of the lane to Davis. Backing in, spins, banks it home. 98-96. Tigers by two, 20 seconds into the second overtime. To throw it in. Left corner, Johnson throws up a three, blocked by Morcel. They get it back to Johnson, and he hits a three. He's four of six from three-point range. Mike blocked the first one. It went to Overton underneath. He threw it right back to Johnson, who nailed the three. We're tied at 99 with 2.58 to go. 15 on the shot clock. Takes it into the paint. Scoop shot up and in. Kirk Lee with 23. We're tied at 101. 15 on the shot clock. Dribbles to his right. Comes in. 15-foot jumper is good. And the Dragons lead 103-101. Lee with 25. Eddie Keith over midcourt. Gets it to Mormon. And the ball goes into the backcourt. And a whistle. And a foul going to be called on Drexel on Johnson. Ties the game up when he's, as he hits the first free throw. 
And now we'll try to give the Tigers the lead. And he does. 104-103 with 41 seconds to go. Feed it left side to Moran. Back to Lee. Eight seconds to go. Lee going to drive. Stop. Banks it. Missed the layup. Rebound underneath. Davis has it with one second left. That's it. The ball game is over. Kirk Lee had a wide open layup and he missed it. It would have won the ball game. But the Tigers hold on to win 104 to 103. Mike Morcel led all scores with 32 points in the game. John Davis grabbed a career high 17 rebounds, which helped him pass Tamaj Parker Rivera on the all time rebounding list for the eighth spot. Tigers are back in action this Saturday at 4 o'clock against the Tribe of William and Mary. That game will also be Towson University's National Autism Awareness Game. For more on the Towson Tigers and Autism Awareness Day, head over to TowsonTigers.com. Reporting for the Towson Sports Network, I'm Ben Rosenbaum.